This will not feel good. So today we're gonna to be trying some facial hair removal products. We're gonna see if these products really work and if they're actually pain-free. I'm skeptical. Removing facial hair sucks. Like growing up, I had like a lot of it. I had like a full-on mustache. I get some stray hairs. Just random ones that just wanna like party by themselves that all tweeds out. Heck yeah, I'm nervous. I mean, your face is kind of like, you can't mess that up. I have a pretty high pain tolerance, I think. It's all very painful. The first thing I thought of when I saw this is it looks like a vibrator. It looks like a flashlight. Okay, this looks scary. Okay, so this is... Whoa! <laughs> this sounds like a vibrator, guys. <laughs> Let's try it on a really hairy part. Oh, it tickles a little bit. Wait, this is cool. It doesn't feel painful at all. <gasps> Ooh. All the hair is gone. This one worked. This did good. I, I like this. This leaves a little bit of stubble. Did I just remove a bunch of my arm hair without realizing it? I did. It was pretty effective. Oh, that's gonna be weird when it grows back. What is this? This is definitely meant to rip out hair. This one looks like it's gonna be painful. I think you get your hair trapped in the spring and then you clamp it down. So you bend it and then do this with it? Okay, this one kind of hurts. It like pinches. This isn't working. It's making me frustrated. Ow! Oh my God, no, it didn't <laughs> I wonder if I can get those little neck hairs. Nope. I wouldn't use this for my entire face. I feel like maybe it would be good for a mustache. I'm gonna keep my little fuzzies. This one's a bit more intimidating. This might actually work. I'm like honestly scared to try this because it looks like it's gonna hurt. Put it on your face and do you open it first? It has these little coils. <gasps> no, I don't wanna do it. I don't wanna do it, I don't wanna do it. Ow. Yeah. Oh. oh my God, I grabbed so much of this hair. <gasps> no. Like your hair is literally being ripped out. That, ow, that felt worse than like a wax strip coming off a little bit. Ooh, this is cool. This is like when you get your eyebrows threaded, right? Before I got laser, I would literally thread my face like every morning. Oh. Oh, it works. Oh, f it hurts. No, my skin got in it. No, ow, no, no, ow. F***ed up. No. I think I broke it. As a brown person, I don't think this is a good way to thread. I would learn it myself if I were trying it at home. Also, I feel like thread is just like, like you buy thread, it's just thread. Like you don't need an extra thing. This works, it just hurts, it hurts a little bit. Pain is beauty and pain is pain sometimes. <laughs> if you can figure out how to use some of these, like all the power to you. But a lot of hair removal, Gadgets are geared towards women's insecurities. I'm down to like try weird beauty things, but they need to do what they say they're gonna do. If they say pain-free, I'm expecting pain-free. I want the people who invented these products to use it on themselves and then give me a call and tell me that it's pain-free. I feel like I need to do my entire arm though, because I have this bald patch. This patch of my arm, very smooth. 